Hello everybody, real quick before this video begins, this is for version 1.0.4 of 5PD. This may change in a future version that you no longer need this. I know the development team is testing some stuff in order to make it so you don't actually need to do this, but this is a workaround fix for now if you're having an issue with the 5PD saying server.cfg cannot be found. So this is a fix for that. There may be, this may be fixed in future versions where you don't even need to do this, but for 1.0.4, this is what you need to do. Just wanted to make that clear that the development team is aware of it and they are looking into other options, but for now, this is the fix, so please enjoy the video. Hello everybody, thank you for tuning in for our double upload today. Today I wanted to just really quickly make a video based on some of the common issues with the newest update of 5PD, and I wanted to go over how you can fix this in terms of how I did it in my tutorial video last time this week. Um, so I wanted to just go over how to fix it. So the error is if, if you open up your server and it loads, it's going to say the server.cfg does not exist. The reason for this is because if you were did my tutorial, it actually broke during our installation, and the newer versions require that your server.data folder be have your um, actual server.cfg. You can see in our tutorial video we did earlier this week, there is two server data folders which 5M created. This is going to break it. So what we have to do is it's pretty simple. You go to your 5M where your server and server data folder is, go into your second server data folder, and pretty much just wait in your first 5M server data, drag this server data into your 5M. Automatically, Windows will combine them, so now you, if you go into your server data, you only have one folder and your server.cfg is here. Go to 5M, go back to your server file, go to your start.bat, right click, press edit with notepad++, just delete this extra server slash server data, save your file, go ahead and start up your server, and you'll see that it will load in exactly how it should be momentarily. There you go, so it's actually loaded in. So it's quick fix, quick easy, just rearrange one file, that's all you have to do. If you need help with this, reach out either in the comments or on my Discord server, I'm happy to help you. I've helped people constantly over the last 48 hours with this. So of course, sorry for the confusion and stuff, this changed in the newer version before. The earlier version I did the video on didn't need this, now it is, so I just wanted to make this quick upload video saying this is how you fix it, this is what you do. So hopefully this helps you out. So if you have any questions, again, let me know down in the comments or on Discord, and I'll be happy to help. I'll see you tomorrow for an official.